Hello and welcome back. How are you doing? Today I will show you how to to add disks or uh, a disk to operating system. So, but before I start the practical side, I will just show you how, uh, the theoretical side because I will use LVM, so Linux Volume Manager or Logical Volume Manager. Um, it's for Linux. So first, you know that we have just a physical hard disk. And from this uh, hard disk, we can just format it using uh, operating system to be a physical partition. Okay, we have um, we can create a physical four physical. Okay, we have um, uh, primary and logical, so we can create a, a physical partition um, from the physical hard disk. I will show you in the. Uh, in the practical side so from this uh, physical hard disk we can create a physical partition and from this physical partition we can LVM to create a, using a VG create to create a group from this uh, physical partitions and from this physical partition we can just logic, uh, create a, a logical volume LV create to create a logical volume from this group so uh, and also we can just specify uh, how much size we need from this uh, volume group um, Okay, uh, this is all for uh, just only the theoretical so we, let's go for practical side so from the VM we need just to edit a virtual machine and from the virtual machine we can just add uh, another hard disk virtual hard disk we can just press add and then from add hard disk from the hard disk keep uh, keep as is it's uh, recommended from vmware scuzzy from scuzzy create a new uh, virtual disk next specify 15 gb this is what i need you can specify what you want uh, um, from here you just create uh, okay pick store virtual disk as a single file next and from here you just you see there is an automatic naming uh, add a zero that's mean this is a first disk for rack finished so this is all so we can just now press ok and try to start the, um, the virtual machine and from the virtual machine we can just uh, the rack one from inside we can just see if uh, if this uh, disk is uh, is added or not also you can specify from here you can see here we have two hard uh, hard disks from here you can see that the hard disk is added successfully but we can also check and uh, be more accurate from the operating system from inside so um, let's try to log in from okay I have booty uh, okay Still not running. Okay. Right now it's running. Root. Okay. Enter the password. So we can just specify ls minus l sd. S, okay, sorry. Uh, div sd start to check, to check okay we have this is uh, all disks we have uh, SDA is for operating system this is the hard disk for operating system separated for two primary or two physical uh, two physical disks uh, first one uh, SDA1 and uh, the second one SDA2 so uh, the div SDB, this is what we add, still draw, so we need just to format it, but before we format it, we need just to do format or F disk minus L to check if it's uh, appear okay. The F disk command can see this um, hard disk, and uh, as you see, it's uh, still raw, we don't have any uh, physical partition for this. So we will try to let the operating system um, um, capable to work with this with this uh, hard disk. So first, 
we need just to do f disk and print the this one um okay press enter so for you i think this is first if you are first time uh, do the if this command you can just uh, write m for manual and you can see all the comments you can check and pick what you want but for me because i i need specific thing i will press m for new uh p for primary and uh, the primary will have a uh, uh, one this one the number you can see here you see this number so if i put one that's mean i have here sdb1 this number will be one so this number same as this one okay so uh, enter so okay first sector the default one is this one i will keep the default and for maximum size i will use this one the default one that mean i will use all the all the the, the hard disk space for one um, for one physical uh, uh, disk okay so here we just need to okay we, we finished we can just press p for print or display what we did you can see here so we have this one this one will be the name and uh, start and end from this one number of blocks and uh, the id but the system is linux and i need to change it to linux vm uh, lvm so i will put minus okay the l capital and then pick this code this one linux lvm so uh, and then i will press t to change the type and put the code enter so you can see change from the partition change from linux to linux lvm so p for to print uh, to print out um this is uh, okay done so we need to write these things okay um the partition table has been uh, altered okay so um let's check using uh, this one so we can see here we have the div sdb1 okay after we create this one we need just to create a vg uh, create uh, create okay to return back for that one for this one we finish this one so we have this one only and the size is um, around uh, 15 gb so we need to use a bv create and uh, to create a, a physical uh, a physical uh, volume for lvm so um, also i prepared uh, some uh, here document so that we can use it for uh, fast okay because i don't want to waste time uh, okay bv create this is to create a physical volume okay okay the physical volume uh, created successfully so we here we we did this one we create the using bv create we have the, now physical partition created and uh, the lvm can uh, handle and work with this uh, partition so how we can just see uh, we can this just only bv display and we can see uh, all the physical uh, volumes we have this one that we created the size is uh, 15 gb so uh, from this one we can okay right now we can just create vg create the volume group create and we have this command i write it here uh, before vg create oracle binary volume group okay so the volume group is created successfully and uh, from here we can just create lv create logical volume ah, okay so here we can just uh, display uh, vg display it will show me the i think or orabin so this is the aura binary volume group this uh, format the lvm2 logical volume uh, 2 
uh, you have all the data here so you can check uh, so right now we can just okay we have a logical volume and we have uh, sorry we have a volume group so from here you can see we have a volume group here so from this one from the volume group we can create a logical volume logical volume it's uh, I will name it uh, I prepare this here uh, logical volume create so we can just create this command is 50 uh, 50 percent free that's mean use the 50 percent of the volume group and then we'll create a uh, half of the that means seven seven uh, seven Okay, uh, yes, 7 GB, uh, around 7 GB. Uh, let's press OK. Then the volume, okay, then create it. So we'll create the another. Uh, another one. Um, I will not use this one. I'll use 100%. That's mean all the okay. So uh, I put one hundred because okay I took the fifty percent of that one so I will use all the other reset. So I will modify this one okay that was good. So I will try just okay we we finish the LVM so we can see LVM. Uh, logical uh, sorry uh, LV logical volume display so we'll display all the logical volumes that uh, I created this is 7 and this is also 7 750 750 okay so uh, let's make a, a fine system for this uh, logical volume so this one will create for okay um, make a file system with extension for make FS extension for uh, for this one okay done uh, I will create also for the other one because we have um, two uh, sorry not one this is L um, this two so um, I will just copy this one paste done so uh, we'll make a directory for uh, I will try also to mount it this one and this one oh, sorry okay so ls minus l uh, u zero star to show okay we have two you see and they are empty so we try to mount this one um okay and mount also two So we need also to edit uh, uh, FS. Okay, uh, sorry, nano etc FS. Tab. So here um, we need just to okay. Control X, CD, Div, Mapper, uh, sorry, um, LS, CD, um, or, ah, oh, sorry, um, uh, BWD. So I will use this one, copy it here. This one is the uh, I will use it to 
amount three as amount point for me. Okay. And okay. And this one. Um use this one. Okay. Now I will try just now to open the okay the FS tab. So here we can just copy this one and change this one to U zero one and remove this one. And uh, copy this one. Okay. And uh, the end. I'll try to copy this one. Change just only the U02. Control X. Yes, I will cut this one. See, change save. Okay, this three minus H. So you can see this mount for this one, and this one for this one, and the use and full. that's it. So this uh, two partition one is for Oracle uh, Grid and. Um, grid infrastructure and oracle binaries uh, the grid infrastructure for um, clusterware and uh, the uh, asm here i will put just the software and unpack them here uh, to be able to install them to the u01 and after i finish i will use it for backup and uh, different uh, another purpose so that's uh, that's it and that's all uh, sorry for uh, make the video too much uh, long so hope see you later see you soon stay tuned thank you for watching